this is sad, but I saw this when I was looking up the uh, Kingsport uh, uh, dead body that was discovered. I was seeing if there, this was yesterday, was the dead body, you know, was discovered on the interstate going through uh, Kingsport, Tennessee. And as y'all know, that's uh, has a correlation uh, with uh, uh, where Summer Wells, the little missing five-year-old, she used to live close to there. And anyway, the, there was interest in that story. Then I saw this, and I thought I'd go out and just to share with you guys. You gotta be careful, y'all. You gotta be careful. So yesterday, it looks like Milligan College uh, cross country track runner Eli Kramer was killed, and two other teammates were injured. These are guys; they're out running. You know, they got scholarships to go to college. Milligan is a small Christian college in um, Carter County, Tennessee. And, um, you know, it's just people go there from all over America. Uh, it's not, I don't think anybody locally goes there. Uh, if you ever meet someone who has a, a Milligan sticker on their car, ask them where they're from, and you'll never hear Tennessee. Uh, usually hear like states like uh, Washington or California or some. These are, uh, uh, I guess it's hard to find Christian schools out there. I don't know. But anyway, so this guy's running and um, the Virginia State Police ended up arresting guy, which I think is funny because this happened in Tennessee. But uh, so the agency arrested Jose Efron, Efrain Hernandez Mancia. Of Williamsburg, Virginia. I don't think that's a old family name in Williamsburg. I don't think that guy is generational Williamsburg. So, you know, just because you live somewhere doesn't mean that you're from there. And I just have to think to myself of those Biden stickers that say, I did this. Yeah, I know. You know where my mind's going. And I hate to think about it again. It, it could be another unnecessary death. If it's true. The only reason why my mind's going there is because it's happened time and time again. And one of the worst I, uh, that happened was the uh, fire chief in Knox County, Tennessee. His son was killed like on Christmas Eve by a uh, illegal immigrant Uh who uh, crossed lanes into traffic. And uh, I think, I don't remember the story. I know that the illegal immigrant is whether or not, like the only thing really that was chargeable for him was that he was illegal. I think that it was just, it was a bad wreck. But it made you think, I was like, you know, it's one of those things that the guy, he was in the wrong place at the wrong time. It has nothing to do with this, but it's just, that was my first instance of seeing somebody, that being an issue immigration and its effect on people's lives um so this guy jose efrain hernandez mancia was uh driving under the influence at 6 p.m when he plowed into five runners with uh milligan college five college students um he, uh, let's see, the guy I'm on involuntary manslaughter, a felony account of hit and run. So hit these guys and he kept on going. Reckless driving, DUI maiming, and DUI refusal to submit to a blood and alcohol, blood and alcohol uh, sample. Um,. Anyway, it's just, it's awful to think about. It's just absolutely awful. So, anyway, this guy here, he's ruined, ruined the lives because at 6 p.m., at some point on a Thursday afternoon, he decided he needed to get wasted. And then he decided he needed to get in his car.
Just don't do it, y'all. Just don't do it. We got Uber now. You know, it just, I mean, look, I don't mind. I don't care. If you're going to get wasted at home, as long as you don't start affecting other people. Anyway, prayers to the uh, Kramer family and all those affected with this. Guys, we got to do better. Got to do better as a society. There's no law that changes this. We, we have all the laws on the books already. You see people don't care. But we got to do better. Anyway, guys. Hit that subscribe button, and I'm sorry I brought you this uh, this uh, negative news story. I try to stay positive on things, but anyway, I just this was all in the news and everything when I started looking up uh, the uh, Kingsport dead body. So, love you guys. Be good to each other. Have a good day. Stay frosty, and Godspeed, y'all. <laughs>